This is a rocket shad. Little tiny spinner bait. And you know what's cool about it? It's a structure bait. Because it's small, it has no resistance. You can throw this thing out in 30 foot of water and it drops. And when it drops, this prop just sits there and turns, the blade just turns, and so it helicopters down. This falls, you know, horizontal, so it's perfect. Little double hook, great for hooking them up, and it stays real weedless. So fishing in depth, it's a, it's a kind of a deep water spinnerbait deal. You can throw it out and just let it tumble down. A lot of times they'll hit it on the fall, so you watch your line. It's just going right down, let it go to the bottom. And then once I hit the bottom, then it's more of a pump, pump it off the bottom retrieve. So I get it down there, it's 20 feet of water and I can just pump it and you feel it go, you know, like a zzz. It just, the blade's turning so fast and you can just pump it off the bottom. You can fish it in trees, believe it or not, it's extremely, extremely weedless because of number one, the double hook, as you can see, so there's not another treble to hook. It comes through stuff and it just doesn't get hung. And because it's more of a horizontal presentation on the hook and the bait, you can bounce through stuff and it just kind of kicks it out of the way. I was really surprised how easy you can work it into the timber and you know vertical work it. So you know, if I spot one, I'm gonna drop it on it. I'm gonna throw it out and let it fall on the bridge pilings work it around, work it around the riprap. You can throw it out on ledges. You can work it up the ledge, down a ledge. Really awesome little bait. You know, in the fall, we have a lot of schooling activity. And usually in the fall, they're smaller baits. And you'll see them jump and you see fish trash them because they're, they're chasing shad back in the pockets and they're trying to feed up before the winter. You talk about a great bait for fall, that's the rocket shad. Looks just like a little bait fish, you know, and minnow and you throw it out there and you can fish it through anything and uh, small and yet you can make super long casts. So if they're blowing up out there and they're a little out of your range, you can hit them with this. And, uh, and then you get it in them and they're, they, they just can't resist it because it's like a little minnow. I do a lot of pumping with this, so you can just reel it straight and if you got schoolers, you can reel it pretty quick. But most of the time I like it coming off the bottom, bouncing on the bottom, pumping it off the bottom, you know, pulling it off the bottom. I like to get in contact and have it deflect off the of stuff and bounce off the bottom. It just seems like I catch more fish that way. You know, Rocket Shad is not a brand new bait. I mean, this bait's been out for a while, but it's very unique. And, and I doubt you'll find too many of your, of your buddies or friends that have it. And so when you get on the bite, you're just gonna be mashing them and they're gonna be struggling to find one. So it's an incredible little bait that is very, very effective. That's what I can't stress enough is how effective it is especially on ledges, drops, smallmouth, you know, spots. They go crazy for this thing. And, uh, and it's so easy to fish. So, you know, you're gonna find situations where you go, oh my gosh, this is the deal. And, and you'll have one like this. Good fish, good fish, come on. Look at them, look at them busting. They just came up here and guess what? Ugh! Rocket shad, baby, love. And look at the hookup. I just wanted to show you this. Just so you can tell, double hook, pinned them. There's never a chance for him to come off. So, I love this bait. Man, you talk about cool, gotta own one, gotta have it in your arsenal. What a great, great tool to have for catching bass is that little rocket shad. Man, come on, let's get another one. That was lots of them. I got a feeling that they had the shad ganged up right there, and that's what's cool. So you, you don't, they're so hard to match a small shad with a bait that you can throw. You know, you can try to throw little crankbaits and stuff, they're harder to throw, get them down on light line and stuff. This thing you can throw, I'm throwing it on 20. You know, so 20 pound Seaguar fluorocarbon. This is actually a Brazex on here, and you can throw it a mile because it's got no wind resistance. It's short, it's small, it's compact, and, and it's just simple to, simple to throw. So, I mean, that's just, just how cool a bait that is. You know, we pull out here, fish for five minutes, and we got one on a lake that is terrible right now. <laughs> it really is fishing, fishing tough, man, I mean tough. So I'm always happy when I catch one. What's cool about the Rocket Shad, you got a, a pretty good size head. And this is one of the smaller ones, it's a 3 8 You can get them up to a half, so they're really big. They all come with these little itty bitty blades. 
and, and they, there's ball bearing swivel, so they spin very easy. It's not like you have to work hard at it. Short little skirt and a double hook. And that double hook really keeps it from hanging up, and, it, and yet it's very good when a fish gets it. It's pinning them in the top. So it's a really small, compact spinnerbait that, that just is amazing for, for making long cast, you know, fishing in schoolies, uh, fishing in heavy cover like you're fishing in a tree, a standing timber. Uh, it's just amazing how weedless it is. So getting a fish to come out of a piece of cover or to bite something in that cover, you know, a lot of times I just got a bite. A lot of times it's, um, it's where, you know, I want to throw a jig in here because it's a tree, right? Well, now that gives you something else because a lot of times the fish doesn't want a jig. You want something flashy, something different, and now you have that option. So uh, it's just another great bait to have in your arsenal that can really help you pick apart a piece of structure, fish deep, have a spinner bait that just really catches them. I love this thing.